I vibed with it in episode two of Rise of Bankton. Okay. <laughs> All right. What is happening, my friends? We are checking out some more BTS today. My moderator extraordinaire just told me that I have heard clips of this behind uh, the Rise of Bankton series, and I was vibing to it. I didn't really know which song it was, but sometimes I'll like be watching something, and I'll just, hey, what's this background music? I really like this. Apparently, that was Attack on Bankton. So uh, we're going to check out the full song here, see how we feel about it. Let's hop in. And I know this is a song from 2013, but it's being performed in 2016. Get out of here. Hey. Hype hip hop. Mm -hmm. You tell more I'm, yeah, okay, 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 okay. I actually don't recognize the, the beat yet, so I don't I don't know which part I was familiar with, but it's not this part. I do want to say the funk hip hop sound that we got going on, kind of jazzy with a with a horn in the background and the, the bass just kind of popping in and out. Woo! Feeling it. Look at these guys, too, with their black and gold. Man, that has a good look. My boy! Dude, and the, and the bang, 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 bang. I think it's a guitar. It sounds really cool, man. I like this beat a lot. Yeah, I hope he does the thing that I did. <laughs> Whenever I hear somebody rap fast, I start going like this with my fingers. I don't know why. He just did that. It made me feel really good. Connected to my man. Huh? Yo, Hobie is so much better live. I was looking for a great word to use, and I, I, I'm not smart enough to come up with it, but... My man, Hobie, I don't know, like, listen, he sounds fine on the tracks, often sounds really good on the tracks, but when he does everything live, I always think that his rap voice sounds incredible live. He steals a show for me so often. I don't know what it is. He's got this intensity about him. It's so funny because he comes with this intensity, but also big, big smile on his face. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like this combination, this juxtaposition. I don't know. I love it. I love it. I love him. Hey, we got a long build up here. Yeah! Hey! Hey! Tay! Give me the growl! <laughs> oh shit, okay. <laughs> One more time. Fire, fire. Okay, that's the part that I've heard. Fire, fire, fire. That's the part that I've heard before. So I've heard that like in the background, right? That's the part that sounded familiar to me. Dude, can I just say that, like, I think one of the things that makes these songs sound so cool, like, later on when they perform it, you know, like I, like I said, it was 2013 song, but it's being performed in 2016. I love that they're kind of, like, chill on the stage. Everyone's just throwing in their own ad-libs. They all seem to feel really comfortable with it now. Probably way more comfortable than they were when the song first came out. I thoroughly enjoy that style of performance from them especially since so much stuff in k-pop can often be like really really uh specifically choreographed where you have to hit every fucking spot all the time that's hard you know but here it seems like they're having fun and they're throwing out the f you know it's just it's getting me it's getting me man fire, fire. 
And it seems like they're just switching everybody just like go ahead guys. Hey. <laughs> Alright, I mean like, come on guys. Come on guys. What kind of fan service is this? Everybody? Everybody get your glasses on? Binoculars times? Maybe a telescope if you need it. It's, it's hip movement time. It's the hip swill moment. <laughs> see, like, he's even laughing with this, man. Like, I love to see it. This is the most fun I've ever ha seen them have on stage before. Wait, what? Is that JK? Yeah, that's JK, right? I mean, I know he raps, it's just 2016. <laughs> Oh man, and you know what else? Like this is this song is just it's just all hip hop, right? This is just a hip hop song with like a cool funk beat behind it. But like they're adding all of their own like melody through with the vocals, right? Because even during the rap part, like right here, da -da 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 -da, like kind of going down the scale. Da -da 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 -da. Hey, live drums too, right? Live drums? Is there a live band here? Live drums, right? I don't, I don't see the band, but that sounded live to me. <sighs> Dude, a V's a growl over here, man. Bring it back, baby. Bring it back. Ah, look at him. He seems so intense. What is up with V in this performance, man? What's going on with this man? He's got some shit to say. He wants people to know. I thought Sugar would be the one that would scream. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, he's so close to screaming all the time anyway with his rap. I thought he'd be the one that I'd hear scream first. Dude, that is... I mean, that is a growl. That's... Uh, we heard... Uh, from V. Uh, Slick. Slick move. Come on, JK. Stop showing off, homie. Come on. Hear the crowd pop there, man? Nice. Ooh, nice flip. Hey. Yeah, he killed that. <laughs> v just went the anti growl route right there. Got some backup dancers? Hey. Hey. A little growl from Jim in there, too.
Damn, dude, that was a fucking great performance. Whoa, go away. That was a great performance. That was that was a gr you know I've heard BTS do all kinds of shit. You know what I mean? Like at this point, I've listened to BTS more than I've listened to like any other K-pop group. You know, probably anybody that I've listened to on this channel, and um, I've heard all kinds of different performances from them. Like you know, very choreographed stuff, very well produced, highly produced stuff, sit down things. You know, whether it's like slower, some stuff that's a little bit in between. And I have seen them kind of break out of the formula a few times, the choreograph formula on a bigger stage and kind of like have a little bit more fun with it. But this one in particular, I think was, was my favorite of that version. You know, the one where they're, they're not doing their, like, you know, there was some choreo, choreo at the end, but it wasn't the same. Like, it wasn't like, okay, guys hit every spot, like all the time. Exactly. This was like, go out there, take one of your OG songs, rap, have fun, throw the mic around. They were basically playing, like, they're all the mics, but metaphorically, they were playing hot potato with the mic. Like, every, every, you go ahead, you go ahead, you know, and then it's like, they were all hitting their parts, I'm guessing, also, but other people were coming in and layering with them, adding some extra notes, blah, blah, blah. It just felt fun, man. It felt fun and hyped. And I just, like, I don't know. I love to see them doing that, man. And V, 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 my boy. You kind of kind of scared me a little bit right there. I mean, in the best way, I like being scared, but a little bit, he has the intensity in his eyes, you know, and his voice. Yeah. <laughs> Good stuff, though.